I didn't know who you were with. It wasn't Brent. That's the only reason why I didn't think it was you. No, it wasn't Brent. I was with a handicapped person. <laughs> <laughs> Moving on to bigger and greater things. Can you seriously? Congratulations on your marriage. <laughs> Everyone else that met him. When am I going to be able to meet him? No, we've, none of us have met him. It ain't going to happen, bitch, because you don't exist. Don't poke the bear, okay? I know y'all didn't have him, but since at least. I talked to him on the phone. <laughs> look at Kim, look at Kim. <laughs> but when are we going to be able to meet him? Soon, hopefully soon. It's all a bunch of lies. Kenya Moore hurls transgender insult at Kim Zalciuk in explosive and number 039 semicolon raw and number 039, clip. Kenya Moore hurls transgender insult at Kim Zalciuk in explosive raw clip. Kim Zalciuk abruptly quit The Real Housewives of Atlanta during filming in the middle of season 5. And a new clip of this Sunday's episode shows she's making sure her return is just as memorable. It all starts at a party at Nene Leak's home during a conversation about Kenya Moore's surprise marriage to businessman Mark Daly, who Kim says doesn't exist. When Marlo Hampton asks Kenya when she's going to get to be able to meet the lucky man, Kim rolls her eyes and says, it ain't gonna effing happen, bitch, cause he don't exist. It's all a bunch of lies, a bunch of bullshit, Kim says to herself as the other women continue to chat about Mark. He don't exist, Kim says once more before Kenny finally snaps. Shut the FCK up, okay? Kenya says. Why do you have such a hard on for me? Didn't they cut it off during your reassignment surgery? Why do you have such a hard on? Whack off somewhere. Jack off somewhere and get it off your chest. And if that's not enough drama for one episode, Bravo's trailer for this week's episode shows that the dispute almost gets physical. After Kim accuses Kenya of having something to hide, Kenya spits back, worry about your life and the daughter you pimp out for John Legend tickets. You cross the mother f***ing line. Kim yells back as she has to be physically restrained from lunging at Kenya. Kenya's blow is in reference to a tweet Kim posted back in May, jokingly asking Chrissy Teigen who her daughter, Brielle Beerman, had to blow in order to meet John Legend at his Atlanta concert. Chrissy ended up replying with this. Two Fab spoke to Kim about her explosive fight with Kenya, which was featured in the season 10 trailer, back in September. She is not a good person, Kim said of Kenya. Don't mess with my man, my money or my kids. At the end of the day, that's it. You don't do it, and she crossed that line. I don't expect her to ever understand because she doesn't have a real husband or children, Kim added. I haven't really met anybody like Kenya, and I hope to never meet anybody like her ever again.